Hey guys, I'm Deep Today Skin and today's video is gonna be a top 5 under 500. I thought of making this like a series, like I might have more series coming up with top 5 under 500. I'm gonna have another series of top 10 under 1000 rupees. So let's get started. The first product I'm gonna be talking about is this Lakme 9 to 5 Primer Plus Matte lipstick this is in the shade rosy sunday now when i first got this i had no expectations for this product at all because i've more often than not been so disappointed with lakme products so i was like okay i'm not gonna have like great expectations with this i'm just gonna try one from this range and see how i like it and when i got this i was so happy with it i really like the formula of this it's not a completely matte lipstick it has a little bit of sheen to it but it wears comfortably throughout the day i mean if you have dry chapped lips it will exaggerate it a little bit and it will cling on to it so exfoliate your lips and moisturize your lips this is what the shade looks like it's not that typical pink shade it has a little bit of coral undertones to it but it's very pretty on the lips i keep this lipstick in my everyday makeup pouch just because i really like the shade i love the lasting power of this you would be surprised at how well it lasts even after you eat like a very big meal even if you have like a big burger this one still remains on your lips i mean it does fade away and it does transfer it's not transfer proof by any means but it does leave a very good stain and a pretty pigmented stain on your lips so i'm really glad that a lipstick is lasting that long on my lips so if you're someone who's looking for a lipstick that is long lasting i think you should go for something like this they do have a wide variety of color selection in this and you can get this for less than 400 rupees when they have like 30 percent off on nika so that's the right time to pick up whichever shade you want they have a good selection of nudes a good selection of pink a good selection of deeper shades as well this is something that i use so much and so often that i had to include this so the next thing i'm going to be talking about is from wet n wild and i have talked about this quite a few times that i feel like a broken record talking about it again but i'm just going to mention it just a little bit this is the wet n wild mega glow highlighting powder in the shade precious petals now there is another shade launched if you are of a lighter skin tone you can try that one out as well and i love how this one looks on my skin i love the formula of this because it looks a little bit wet on my skin and the reason i keep emphasizing about these wet textured highlighters is because those kind of highlighters don't emphasize the texture on your skin all that much and you can subtle it down as compared to something that is a lot more intense so this one does emphasize a little bit texture it's not very natural of course it's a highlighter but it's not too much and i really like how it looks like a sheen and it looks like a glow from within if you apply it with a very light hand and you can definitely build this one up as well i really like it and this is definitely my favorite highlighter so far so next product i'm going to be talking about is this nika k liquid radiant shadow this is in the shade earthly bronze it's what i have on my lid today i was really impressed with this product i mean there are a few things you have to keep in mind when you're using this it would be a lot better if you have like a all over lid shade and apply this on top of it just for a little bit of glitter effect and a little bit of intense shimmer on your eye but if you want to apply this on its own it's a little bit patchy because this is what the applicator looks like it looks like a nail polish applicator and when you first draw that one swipe it is pretty pigmented but you can see the place where i applied it is a little bit pigmented but as you drag it it gets a little bit patchy so what happens when you keep layering it up is that it becomes a little bit flaky on your eye that's the reason i recommend using an all over lid shade and just use Using this as a topper rather than using this as an eyeshadow by itself but look at this this is how amazing it is i'm the kind of person that if i'm getting ready i want my makeup to be done really quick and this is a lazy person's dream in a tube if you want your eyeshadow to look a little bit intense and shimmery you should go for something like this it's really affordable this is priced at 395 rupees but more often than not nika has a sale on nika k all the time so that's the right time to pick this one up it goes down to about 320 rupees or 300 rupees they have a pretty good shade selection in this one as well and i want to try out more options in this because i'm really impressed with this next part i'm going to be talking about is also from wet n wild i can't I can't help it. When Wet n Wild launched in India, I just wanted the prices to be affordable and they did a good job in keeping it affordable and they have amazing products. So there's nothing wrong with including their products in this. So this is the Mega Last Liquid Lipstick in the shade Give Me Mocha. This is what I have on my lips today. I love this shade and I also love the formula of this. But there are other shades from this range that I'm really looking forward to trying probably in the near future it's not very long wearing on the lips it does fade away sooner than a lot of other liquid lipsticks but it's very comfortable even if you have dry lips it's not very uncomfortable on the lips like today i haven't even applied a lip balm and i love how it sits on my lips it's 
transfer proof the only problem is even with a light meal it fades away a lot sooner this is again a product that i use so often i keep alternating between so many lip products and this shade is amazing because it's not like that typical nude it has a little bit of warm undertones to it so it looks really nice when you don't have a full face of makeup on and you want something on a daily basis nothing too loud and nothing too bold but nothing too subtle as well that is when something like this can come to the rescue and when the formula is right and the price point is amazing there's nothing that can beat a product like this so the last product i'm going to be talking about is not a makeup product it is a char gel this is the body shop strawberry char gel as you guys can see i'm almost out of it i just have this much product left this one is for 325 rupees but when there's a sale on nika get it for about 270 rupees which is amazing and i never thought that i'd go back and buy a char gel again because i usually get really bored with the scent and the formula that i want to try out something different but this is something that i went back and got and i'm done with it so i'm going to be repurchasing it again it has the most amazing scent to it so delicious and you get 250 ml of product in this and it's gonna last you for about two months if you shower once a day when you apply this on your body you feel really luxurious you feel good when you use this and this one has strawberry seed oil in it so every time i use it it's not very drying and it's not very itchy so if you have very sensitive skin or if you are prone to dryness a lot more you can try something like this because it has that oil infused in it and it's a really good product for the price if you don't really like strawberry scents you can definitely go out and try so many other scents but this is a product that i would recommend each and every one of y'all to try so that's pretty much it i hope you guys enjoyed this video and found it helpful do comment down below and let me know what are the products that is less than 500 rupees that you really like and you think i should try out for the next episode of this and don't forget to watch my previous videos i'll leave it right here so i'm pretty sure this is something that's going to interest you and don't forget to subscribe i'll see you guys in my next one bye